Hello grade 9 math class, welcome back to another lecture. We have lesson 7 today, which is the first part of 3 for bed mass. We are going to just quickly go over the rules of bed mass and uh, just jump right into some problems. Some of them are a little bit complicated, the numbers are a little bit large, so you're going to have to do the work um, to you know add and subtract as usual, uh, generally without a calculator. Okay, so brackets comes first, that's why we have the B for bed mass. E exponents come second, and we're gonna deal with exponents later on, probably not in bed mass one, maybe in bed mass two or three. We are going to do then division and multiplication from left to right, and that's key. We always go from left to right. There is only one right answer when it comes to these questions, so we must do them in order. Brackets, exponents, division and multiplication from left to right, and then addition and subtraction from left to right, that is key. Uh, we are also going to be uh, multiplying numbers by a set in a bracket. I'll show you what all this means. You can go ahead and read it, but we will see in examples, no problem. Let's do the first one. I'm gonna do a different color. All right, let's do, we've got 12 divided by six times 11. We are going to do this in order from left to right because it is all division and multiplication. There is no brackets, no exponents, so there's no addition and subtraction, it's just left to right. 12 divided by 6 is 2, and then multiplied by 11 is 22. So these questions we are going to be coming up with an answer. That is our goal. First one, not too bad. We could do that. Do the second one. 9 times 8 plus 9. Okay, we go down our hierarchy. We got brackets. Yes, we do. So we do what's in the brackets first. So this is the same as 9 times 17. And when we have a number right beside a bracket, we multiply those together. So 9 times 17. Uh, let's go ahead and do it how we always do. 9 times 7 is 63. A little 6 to add. 1, 3, 6 plus 9 is 15. That's 153 for our answer for this one, okay? So all of these numbers, although 9 times 17 may seem a little daunting, you can go ahead and do it just as we always do. Let's go to a couple more. We have next 8 plus 7 times tw or 12 minus 3. Okay, so we go down our hierarchy. Do we have any brackets? Yes, we do. Let's do those. 8 plus 7, we write here, and then 12 minus 3 is 9. Okay, now we're going to, we have no exponents, so we're going to do multiplication and division from left to right. So, multiplication and division. 7 times 9 is 63, so this is 8 plus 63, which ends up being 71 for our answer. So we're going to do brackets, multiplication, division, and then addition and subtraction. Let's do a couple more, a couple more. We've got 32 divided by four, and these are in brackets, but not with each other, just next to each other. When you have two things in brackets next to each other, that represents multiplied by each other. Since they are not in brackets together, then we do not do that first. Um, it is just like writing it like this. 32 divided by four multiplied by four plus six. It's just showing that those two fours are multiplied by each other. So since there's no brackets and there's no exponents, we're gonna do division and multiplication from left to right. 32 divided by four is eight, and then multiplied by four is 32, right? We divide something by, uh, by four, we multiply it by four, it's gonna be exactly the same. So that's 32 plus 6, which ends up being 38, okay? So this is a key example where it's important to go from left to right. Let's do a couple more. I think we got two more. Yes, we do. 7 in brackets and 13 in brackets plus 5 in brackets and 11 in brackets minus 12. Okay, so although there are brackets, there's nothing in brackets to do. These are just multiplied by each other. So we're, let's do 7 times 13 and 5 times 11. So I know that this is 55. Let's just do that. 7 times 13, let's go. Uh, 
seven. We have a 21, a two for adding. It's 91, so this is 91 plus 55 minus 12. I know I always, uh, you're supposed to do it from left to right, but to make it easier, I'm gonna subtract 12 from 55. Um, it's going to be much easier for me to add these together later. So this is 91, uh, this is plus 43 then, and then added these together. Uh, this is 134 for an answer. We have one more problem. One more problem to do. I hope that you're getting the hang of these as we go in order. Brackets, uh, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Let's go. 22 plus 72 divided by 9 plus 11 minus 9. No brackets, no exponents. I do see some division. So let's go ahead and do that first. 22 stays. 72 divided by 9 is 8 plus we have 11 minus 9. Well, that's just 2. 11 minus 9 is 2. I'm going to go ahead and do that. So that means we have 22 plus 8 is 30, plus 2 is 32. Final answer of 32. In the end, um, adding and subtracting usually works out OK, no matter which order you do it in. Uh, go ahead and give a whole bunch of these questions a try, and we'll move on to bed mass 2 when you're ready uh, for a little bit more complicated questions. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you soon.